What's up guys? Welcome back to Landmine University. Coach Canellis here. I'm going to give you guys a quick hack to set up a jammer arm in your uh, own training facility, even if you don't have access to that equipment. So today we're going to be using a kettlebell jammer. We did this ourselves. You can see we tied a belt squat belt around the rack and then we threw a chain through it, threw a heavy kettlebell. But you could just do this with a long chain or any towing strap that'll get the kettlebell down. You can also play with the height. The cool thing about this is that we're going to be able to apply some of our same Landmine University systems with an opposite strength curve. So where the Landmine gets easier towards the top, this kettlebell is actually going to get tougher as it gets higher through the movement. We can do a lot of the same positions and functional training that we use with the Landmine. Now when you're gripping this thing, the way I like to do it is grabbing the round part of the kettlebell. So you can see I've got my hands on the short side of the kettlebell, my fingers are in the middle, my thumbs on the outside. And then we can get our palm on the kettlebell. It's a great surface area, feels really good. And when we're doing these movements, we're trying to keep the strap tight. So we're using that Landmine University forward intent. We're driving down into the strap the entire time. It's really gonna open up a floodgate of exercises that we can do where we can take the Landmine University principles and do even more creative explosive training. All right, me and the guys are gonna take you through a couple of our favorite movements with this thing. Let's get it cracking. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed that. You guys can play with that. Play with different strap lengths to sort of play with that strength curve. You can definitely load that heavier than we did today. Let us know what you think. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you next time at Landmine University.